Hi, it's Lisa Gormley here, or Lisa Barry, as I'm still known on LinkedIn. Haven't got around to changing that yet. Uh, I'm just making a video for the wonderful Nikki Simpson from the International Magazine Centre on her My Favourite Magazine project. Um, so the magazine that I have chosen, and it's a difficult task to choose just one, um, is something that's actually helped me through lockdown, and that is Psychology's magazine. Uh, so it's just a bit of light reading, um, but it's something that I think helps you learn at the same time as uh, getting a bit of an escape. Um, I do actually remember the first 10 minutes that I got to myself uh, without my children in lockdown. Uh, I just had a cup of tea and sat down with this magazine and I honestly felt completely restored afterwards, after just 10 minutes. Uh, so, you know, it does mean a lot to me in, in the sense that it was uh, my salvation <laughs> during a very difficult time. So essentially this magazine is all about well-being and um, health, mental health in general. Um, so, I, you know, it is a useful kind of resource any time in life, but certainly during, as I said, these stressful times. Um, one of the things that uh, certainly as a marketer, that I found really great about this magazine is uh, the little kind of facts that you get throughout that just give you such um, good insights into people. Um, and, you know, they're easy to digest and um, a good kind of takeaway. So you kind of feel like you've been productive whilst reading. Uh, I do also like um, that there are people, say, that look like me in this magazine rather than um, just all sort of skinny model types. They've got good kind of um interspersal of uh, animation and oh look i mean that's definitely me um images uh that are real but also let's see if i can find it you know things like the images that are pretty this is a great example of um one of the things i like about um the imagery in this magazine um they use the kind of uh, method that was used in those uh inspirational posters you see everywhere from the 90s um but you know it, it does it does make you feel good to look at images like this and to see a positive quote around it kind of makes you feel like you really should could take on that kind of mantra see look there's one of the absolutely amazing nature images um with a lovely quote to go along with it they uh can make you feel a lot better even just looking at them <laughs> and there's more of the facts that I think uh, make this magazine really kind of educational as well as um, enjoyable and then you've got of course um, the interior stuff uh, which is kind of halfway between um, Instagram and a real life home because, you know, magazines are physical, you can touch them and they have that feel of being um, carefully curated, on like, unlike the online stuff uh, where you're supposed to believe that this is all just real life and that's how everything looks all the time. Sorry for the extreme lack of continuity in this video, although it does give you an idea of how I would consume psychologies. Uh, there are different sections depending on what mood I'm in or how much time I've got. And uh, it's pretty much everything you would want from a social media feed. It's informative, it's inspiring, um, but it doesn't disappear in two seconds flat. And it gives you a chance to regroup, um, consume at your own pace, and there's no comment section. So that is why it is my favourite magazine.